to say that I am super shocked by this would be lying to you. I don't believe that anybody who is an Alabama fan should be shocked by this. Caleb Downs is leaving Alabama or at least has his name in the transfer portal. And you might as well say that he's leaving. I don't know if you can convince him to come back at this point. And I honestly believe that if he wanted to stay, he would never fill out the paperwork in order to leave. And my first an initial thought is that he is going over to Georgia to play with T-Rob. And this is why Alabama did their best to try to keep T-Rob there by offering him the defensive coordinator position. But he did not want that. He went over to Georgia to work with Kirby Smart. And Caleb Downs is also from Georgia. He went to school at Mill Creek High School. He was the number one safety in his class at the time. And so for him to go back to Georgia would make the most sense. But if you haven't already, make sure that you guys subscribe to the channel. I am on the way to 1,000 subscribers. I think I'm at around 590 at the recording of this video. And I would love the support. It's free, guys. Help your brother out and hit that subscribe button now let's get into the video i made a video yesterday detailing the new coaching hires the defense coordinator and the co-defense coordinator kane womack and marius linguist and apparently i don't know this to be factual but it seems that caleb downs is not feeling the hires or he feels as if t rob is a much better candidate for his career and i think that may be the most important factor especially if we see him go to georgia i think t rob was a deciding factor now other things could play a part in this even if he doesn't go to georgia who else could potentially be on the table i think a ohio state a texas hell even a texas a and m are all on the table he could go wherever he wants in the country nobody is going to tell him no and so whatever he wants he can get but i think it's going to be more of a fit situation and that's why i continue to say georgia it doesn't seem to be a money grab that's why i believe he's going to georgia and he's going to a place where he believes the staff in place is going to get him nfl ready looking at this tweet right here breaking Alabama DB kept down plans to enter the transfer portal. Downs totaled 107 tackles, one fourth fumble, and two INTs. 2023 was named a freshman All-American, SEC Freshman Player of the Year, and Sean Alexander Freshman of the Year. And so I'm pretty sure as you all know, this is a huge blow. This was the number one guy going into next season he was going to be the man especially on the defensive side of the ball caleb downs is a playmaker and this is a huge loss for the alabama christian tie but as i stated in my previous videos i just want this saga to be over i want to know who is all going to be here when the dust settles so we can continue to now move forward with the new regime and i'm not mad at caleb downs i don't think anybody else should be mad at caleb downs caleb downs in my honest opinion handled this better than anybody else he sat back waited to see exactly what was going to happen i don't know if he's talked to the defensive guys already i'm pretty sure that he has i haven't seen anything that shows that he did but i'm pretty sure that he did and what he heard and what they told him obviously wasn't good enough and that's fine that's okay he is doing what he believes is best for his career and like i said i honestly think he's going to georgia i could be completely off on that but it is what makes the most sense to me in my brain at this very moment and i'm reacting to this news fresh it happened almost 15 minutes ago from the time of this recording and so i could be completely wrong on the georgia prediction and even with this news i am still super excited for this season i know nick saban is gone caleb downs is gone trey amos is gone isaiah bond is gone so many others are gone as well but guess what guys it is perfectly fine we knew things like this were going to happen and with caleb downs being gone he probably won't be the last one to leave it may be people in the locker room who may follow caleb downs to where he goes just because that's his home like i said previously i'm just ready for the dust to settle i want to see who's going to be left standing so we can continue to move forward there's nothing we can do about it now i did hear that a new cornerback may be coming to town hopefully so because we're going to need a little bit of help on the defensive side of the ball now jabbar muhammad may be coming from washington and there may be some more things that may start to go into the tide's favor we don't know yet there's just so much unknown right now losing somebody like caleb down does hurt 
could he reverse and come back sure but it's not looking likely let's see what happens either way it goes it's still road tie guys i see y'all in the next video let me know what you think your thoughts and opinions on this entire situation i'm out